tutorial number 7 on Vista software I will show you how to transform from a unit cell to a super cell here I have a super cell in the Vista software go and click on the file open I'll be showing an example of NACL the CI file I have used here is downloaded from COD website if you are new to my channel then do check out my previous video in which I have shown how to download CI file for free and also how to get the Vista software. So let's select the CI file, click open. And here you will see a unit cell of NACL. Now let's go and click on the edit. And first I want to remove the bond. So click on the bond. Over here you will find the bond. If you don't want to show this bond, just delete them and click apply. So it will help you to remove the bonds. Now go and click on the edit, edit data and go to the unit cell now click on the transform and over here you will find transformation matrix if you change number over here 1 to 10 or whatever number you want then it will help you to transfer this unit cell along the x axis if you click over here and change this number it will help you transform both x and y similarly if you choose this option then it will help you to transform along x y and z axis okay once selected then click on ok click yes and it will ask you add a new equivalent position to the list of symmetric operation search atom in the new unit cell and add them as a new site do nothing so just check the default option that's the number one click ok and then click on the apply button okay so now you can see the unit cell has been transformed from a single unit cell to a super cell okay in the bottom now if you come back and check the output you will see the abc values has been multiplied by 2 whereas the xyz cartesian coordinate has been divided by 2 you can compare these supercell values with the values of the unit cell which shows abc equal to 5.62 and the xyz equal to 0 0.5 0 0.5 0 0.5 i hope through this video you learn how to transform from unit cell to supercell do like share and subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon button to be updated with my new videos.